Hello, ladies and gents. I'm Papa, and I'll be your host for the match between Pogo and Haru. Um, let me just turn on Pogo sound. There you go. Um, <laughs> I'm doing everything tonight. Uh, I rest I'm restreaming. I'm commentating. Uh, as far as I know, I'm going to be solo for the commentary. I'll do my best uh, to do a good job. So, yeah, don't, please, <laughs> please be nice to me, okay? This is my first experience as a solo commentary. Um, we'll see how it goes. Um, I can't hear Pogo's game for some reason. This is uh, surprising. What is going on? What is going on right now? <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Okay. What about Harris? Oh my dude. Uh. Oh no. Thank you, Chris. Okay. We're waiting for Haru to launch her game. And yeah, then I think we got this. Hopefully we get some sound on Haru's side. Yeah, we do. Let's go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> At least one of them is having sound. Uh Okay, looks like the game is already, um, so I'll, okay, Pogo is coming back, and we'll stop, see you okay. <laughs> this is a mess, dude, <laughs> doing everything so, like, it doesn't look like it, but managing the layout and uh the volumes and the streams and commentary and the bingo start with the card and everything it's kind of a lot of things to do turn up the mic okay there you go all right so we're waiting for pogo to come back uh we're gonna keep our sound because pogo for some reason is not working i guess could try again but yeah still off it's fine though it's, it doesn't really matter anyway uh, and I hope you like this Electrodome Mario Kart 8 deluxe music uh, I don't know I wanted to listen to this so you guys had to and yeah. so I don't know if you guys have watched have seen the other matches today I played against Mr. Yado. JJ played versus um, uh, JJ played versus Shadow Frost, and uh, Danny played versus uh, MD Mason. So Danny won, I think, thirteen to eight or nine. I won my match versus Mr. Yado, thirteen to seven, and JJ won. 13 to 6 or 7. That is 13 to 10. Nice, I'm giving false information. <laughs> I should have just stated who, who who won which games. Like this I knew. The scores I kind of forgot. <laughs> uh, yeah, so the bracket has moved a lot today. 13 5. Yeah, I mean, I was watching the game on and off, and um, basically it was 6-5, I look away and then it's 13-5, I'm like, what the heck just happened there? Okay, it looks like both gamers are ready now. So we're gonna do the countdown, and I'll stop the, um, the timer, actually. They're ready. Okay. Five, four. 
There we go. And they're gone. Transition. Here we go. <laughs> All right. So what do we have here? Uh, 11 blues from Delfino. Seven red coin shines. Three hundos. That's very interesting. Uh, Ride Yoshi in two worlds. Hundo from Bianco. What happened? Bianco for Floodless. Twelve from Pina. Five hidden shines. Eight total. One from each. Three from four. Seven bluebirds. Hundo from Pina. Hundo from Sirena. Okay, so the, the card is basically telling you which hundos you're expected to do. Pienta three no damage. That's interesting. It seems like it gives options to what to do. Um, at the beginning, like you could see, I mean, let's read the last two worlds first, but yeah, I think there are multiple options here. Um, two hidden gelato, five NPC blues. That's also interesting for Serena stars, actually. 50 total, two turbos, four secrets, 60 totals, one hidden in Bianco, 15 blues from Gelato, six pipes, and 26 shines. Okay, this card is interesting. Um, it's interesting because you have one from each, not one from each, not one from each, it's not that, that crazy, but basically when you want, when you start, there's like the go-to fastest goal that you can get, right? Like Hundo in Pianta or Hidden Bianco or Bianco 4 Floodless or three bosses. And on this card, it's like there are multiple of them. So you have Pianta 3 no damage, that's pretty fast. These are pipe. Uh, shines too for the six pipes. You can do Hidden in Bianco or you could do Bianco 4 Floodless. Um, like these are all somewhat viable options. Like Pianta 3 no damage is progress for 3 from 4. You can get blues there. Uh, there are only two blue goals on the cards, 50 and 60, which are pretty close. Um, there's also the two hidden in gelato. Like, if you think you're gonna get uh, outsped by the other runner, you might want to go to, to for a gelato rush and do the hiddens there and to try gravitate towards the five hidden shines and blues instead of the. Oh, that's the AD as well? Oh, it is. Indeed, yeah. Yeah, I guess, I guess one of the routes that would make sense here would be to go to Bianco, obviously, doing Bianco 3 hidden or Bianco 4 threadless. I don't know, depending on which one you're the most comfortable with. Uh, probably Bianco 3 reds into Bianco 4, so you don't have to scroll. I mean, I guess you can go back to the secret in 5, so it's fine. But yeah, that would be one move. And the other one here would be to get the Delfino Blues and Delfino Shines to get fast into um, Gelato, do the Hiddens, and then, depending on what your opponent did, adapt. Like maybe grab a Hundo in uh, Sirena fast. Like, it's not that fast to get Hundo in Sirena, but you can do it in one if you want to. Uh, it's a Pipe Shine, so maybe do like... I mean, you, you could get to gelato you do doing pienta shines pienta is pretty fast so i don't know i kind of like this card it's an interesting one there's definitely options for routing and i'm very curious to see what the runners decide to do in terms of execution um pogo's any percent pb is a 119 19 i think i mean it's a 119 1x i think or maybe 09 so he's faster than haru Haru has a, has a current has currently um, a 121 or very low 122. Um, so yeah, they're not that different in terms of speed, but Pogo has been running for way longer. Uh, he also runs 120 shines. Um, yeah, Pogo is a uh, better CD too. Let me um, pull up the the seeds actually. Pogo is seed five in the tournament, so that's pretty good. And Haru is seat 21. So that's respectable. You know, I'm seat 22, so I have to respect Haru for having a better seat than me. Uh, so yeah. <laughs> and I have beaten Polo, a uh, Pogo before in a scrim, in my first scrim. So there's a chance that Haru wins. Okay. Game is not over yet.
And with a card like this, where it's not only about execution, but also about finding the correct route to adapt to your opponent, if you can play your cards well, there, there's a chance you can you can pull it off, even uh, as Haru here. I believe, I believe in Haru this game. Okay, there's a chance. So, yeah, my prediction would be that Pogo knows he's faster and goes for the Bianco stuff. Because he knows he's, he can outspeed, outspeed Haru on this. So either Haru realizes this and goes for something else, like Pienta. Early Pienta, I think it's pretty solid. Okay, it gives you pipes, it gives you d no damage. Um, and it gives you progress towards Gelato. But you gotta unlock Bianco at some point. So maybe Pienta 3 into Bianco unlock, into Underbell, into Gelato Hiddens. Um, and then maybe go to Rico, do a third Hidden there. Um, and then the route kind of uh, suffers though. Um, yeah, I don't know how to how to complete this then. You can grab grab a lot of blues though in uh, in Pienta. You can get like nine, 15 in um, in one and two, and the three in, there are three coins in uh, exclusive to Pienta three, but you will take the risk of taking damage there because of all the gummies that spawn. So yeah, that's that's a risk to take if you want to to go for this. High tech incoming. There we go. <laughs> Alright, so what did the runners decide to do? Pogo is bonking. And Haru takes the lead, you see? Nothing is played yet. <laughs> Alright, let's right here. There we go. Alright, both players are setting up for the jail coin. Pogo misses the coin and Haru misses the coin too. Okay, that's actually pretty bad considering the 11 blues from Delfino Plaza. Missing this coin right now is pretty costly. Like, it, it's gonna cost, I don't know, 7 to 15 seconds depending on the runner um, to get it later. So yeah, that's pretty bad. <laughs> None of them wanted to do this. Obviously to miss the coin. This is uh, unfortunate. Um, yeah, so I guess no one, none of them is going for the Pienta play. Are we gonna see them both go to Bianco first for that hidden Bianco for Bloodless move? Like, it makes sense, but if you know you're slower, and obviously, like, Pogo is very experienced in routing cards, uh, I don't know. We'll see. Okay, Haru is getting blues on the way, so I assume it's not gonna be a Bianco rush from Haru. Hmm, interesting. Pogo is going to Bianco though, okay. So... Yeah, let's see where Haru decides to go. I'm very curious. Now, now you kinda let go of the Bianco 3 reds and Bianco 4. At least one of them. I mean, uh, yeah, there's, if there were like four red coins, a good play I think from Haru here would have been to go for like Pachinko after Bianco 2 or Bianco 3, to like take some time and let Pogo get the first goal and then snag the other one. Unfortunately, it's not on the card, so it doesn't really make sense to talk about this and like do pachinko here would be a move to unlock a level basically but not to get the red coins that that early I guess all right side peep movement and both of them entering PD okay okay that's uh that is the race, guys. <laughs> what are you supposed to say on this right now? They're both doing the same thing. It's fine, though. We'll see how the P fight goes. Um, 
Yeah, so I don't know which one are, are they gonna focus first. Uh, between red, like... There is some synergy doing the hidden Bianco, right? Since there are the five hiddens. Like, if you did Bianco for Fredless and you get sniped on hidden Bianco, you don't want to go back and do this one, right? It's a red coin and it's a hidden. But it's late, right? So you might as well just go for this as fast as possible and then do Bianco 4. I guess. But... Ah, uh, I don't know. It's a, it's a tough, it's a tough call on this one. Okay, Poe grabbing the shine and Haru doing the same. It was two clean, clean fights, I guess. I didn't see any major me mess up. Um, and I need... There we go. Tiny adjustments on the layout. <laughs> you didn't see anything. Uh, there you go. Full screen. There you go. Okay. So Poco is going back in, doing Bianco 3 as expected, and so is our Haru. Um, yeah, that's gonna be tough for Haru. Like, this is a bold move to go for this, knowing you're slower. Um, I mean, you never know. I did die doing the hidden in Bianco on, in my screen, so, I mean, in my match. So there's always a, a chance you can grab it for, from the faster player. But you shouldn't count on this. You shouldn't count on this. We'll see. There's no life uh, incentive on this card. Um, what would be the move after the hidden in Bianco here as Pogo? Most likely Bianco for Fredless, like it's right there. And then probably the hidden gelato. You have the shines to go there. It's two hidden accessible. That's gonna be one red shine, red coin, one secret for the four secrets. Um, yeah, he's going back in. Makes sense. Uh, that's gonna be two. That's gonna be the three from gelato too. If you want to do three from four, you already have three from Bianco. You go do the two hidden gelato. That's three from gelato. Um, then you can go and do pienta three hundred damage. Unless you sniped Haru on both Hidden and Floodless. Oh, wait. Pogo is doing Floodless. Ah, uh, Interesting. No! He's doing Floodless! Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Haru, one, when Pogo clicks this, go to the secrets. Go to the secret, Haru, as soon as Pogo clicks this. Ah, uh, but Haru had to gamble on this. And Pogo just big-brained this. Yeah, maybe it's this. I don't know. Uh, Pogo is about to click. There is no delay clicking this, like, in, in no world, yeah. Okay, it doesn't get delay. Okay, what does Haru decides to do now? Okay, he's going to the... Po Wait. Blues? What? Okay, I guess so. There was a blue right there. Come on, Haru! Go for the hidden! You got this! It's yours! Okay. I mean, that's a trade. Um, unfortunately, like... Is Pogo going back? Pogo is going back for the hidden. Which makes sense, right? Since Haru didn't click the hidden yet, maybe Haru's doing something else, like Pienta or something else. So like, oh come on, Haru, don't lose the hidden. No, Haru, oh my. God. Okay, let's go. Let's. Oh my. Oh, it's gonna be close now. No. Okay. Haru's ahead by like. Seven seconds or so, and bonking, and Pogo does 120 shine, so he's probably very comfortable with this level. Oh no, 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 this is bad. If Haru does like one mess up, she's gonna lose the, lose the goal. Okay, that's a, a decently clean uh, red so far though. 
Yeah. Okay, it's better on Haru's side. All right. <laughs> Drum rolls. And do we get this? Do we get this done? No! 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 I do. That's insane. Okay. This is this is so crazy, dude. Okay, this is tragic for Haru now. Oh no. Okay, um... Haru, what? No, this is so bad. Oh no. Okay, what do you do as Haru now? What do you even do? Um... Why is Haru going to Riko? Oh, this is bad. The nozzle, I guess? No. It's not rockets. The secrets? No. Oh. Oh, it's bad. Oh, no. Oh, no. Like, Haru was in, in the level. And took the time for this M and this Pienta. And then had so much trouble getting into the secrets. Oh my, it's... Oh, it's tragic. Okay, let's... Let's see. Can Haru catch back on this? Okay, Haru seems to be rushing... What? Blues? Blues from Delfino? Okay, okay. Uh, you missed one blue, but fine. It's just behind you. Um, oh, you got your clip through. It's fine, though. I mean, no, it's not fine. <laughs> you still missed that blue coin. Uh, oh, no, that's that's bad. Pogo is going for the blues from uh, Gelato. Yeah, there's also 15 blues from Gelato. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, this is going to be a... This is probably going to be a one-sided match now. Like, this is so bad for Haru. Having gone to Bianco and having lost both of these goals. Like, this is what I was saying. Like, knowing you're slower, this is a risky move. And the way things went out, like, turned out, it's so bad. Okay, Haru is going for the Pienta play, which makes sense. We've established that before. It's okay. Um, and let's remember that Pogo has no idea where... Haru has been like he probably knows like he, he's probably confident that Haru did some Bianco stuff and got sniped but sniping the two goals Pogo must must be confused about this like there is no boss goals on this card right no there's no bosses um, so one thing that could have made sense would have been to do Serena one as a pipe and two NPCs. Um, Serena one as a pipe and two NPCs. But yeah, and that's access for one secret, I guess. Yeah, this was a pretty, pretty good, uh, pretty good hidden. Except the ending. Except the ending when Haru went to that. Uh it's fine. It's uh This happens. This happens. Haru took some risks, wanted some blues from uh, Bianco for some reason. Like why would you get these blues anyway? There is no M goals, there is no Oh and PC blues, okay. I, I understand the, the Pienta play then. Like getting that that NPC was decent was a decent play. Knowing you're rushing though, <laughs> and you're against someone faster. And you might mess up the movement. That's a risky move, but it it makes sense in the context of the five uh, five NPC lose. The M, I'm not so sure. Like the M, I definitely not sure. It was right there, but you had to stop moving. Like Haru started the, her movement towards uh, the secret, and I was like, "Oh, there's an M here. We stop and." Grab this one real quick. <laughs> oh no. Okay, Pogo getting the 15 blues. 
uh, Ingerado into into the hidden. Makes total sense. Yeah. He clicks the 15 blues instantly. And Haru is about to get to... Haru is about... Oh, wait. I messed it up. My bad. My bad, guys. I messed it up. <laughs> I messed up the layout myself. It's all good now. <laughs> I zoomed in my Twitch and everything got messed up. Okay, let's see how Haru's no damage goes. Is she gonna go for railing, tree, momentum spin or river? It is a river move, okay. Respectable. Um, when Paper did this, Rimado acknowledged that it was a decent move since you have two blues on the way. I still prefer the momentum spin. It's cooler and like it looks cool. Style points, they matter, okay? If you lose seconds, but gain style points, you still win. This is how it goes. Alright, where is Pogo do going now? Okay, he's gonna do Cup Secret. Oh, he's gonna do Jelly Skip 2.0. I mean, 2.0? Just Jelly Skip, right? Okay, there you go. Nice. I haven't kept track, he's probably at 4, 5, 6, between 4 and 6, blues from Delfino. Uh, he, he will click it though when he has it, so it's it's all good. I'm not keeping stats, unfortunately. Wait, I haven't seen. Oh no, did I? Oh no. I wasn't looking at Haru's side. Did Haru take damage? After she got... Oh, no. Okay. Um, this is this is a rough for Haru now. Um, between the, the Bianco double snipe and the greediness, I, I'd say, for these three blues. That's gonna be a... Oh, the, the wind, the wind, the wind, the wind, the wind! Oh, my dear. Full damage, yeah. That's what I realized when I saw damage in the chat and Haru down there was like, uh oh. Okay. Haru going back a third time. It makes sense. It's not clicked. Uh, you see Gelato, you see Bianco. You're safe on this one, but you're gonna waste a lot of time compared to Pogo going for actual goals during the time. Hmm. Like now Pogo has the lead on shines, on blues, uh, Delfino blues, got, got clicked, he's going back for the second hidden, so that's gonna be a secret, that's gonna be a hidden, uh, he's gonna have so much progress towards Pina and the right Yoshi, and the 12 blues in Pina, and the birds, and the NPC blues, I mean, there's not NPC in Pina, but, no, actually, Pogo has no NPC blues, my bad. Oh my dude, Haru! <laughs> oh my, oh my, oh my dude! Okay, Haru must be fucking pissed now. <laughs> this is kind of bullshit, dude. Like the, the goop spawned under her, under Mario right there. Okay, Haru is giving up on this, which is understandable. But I wouldn't, I don't agree with this. Like, it is understandable that you're pissed that you died three times at this shine. But, you're here and you know you can get this. That's a free goal for you. Okay, that's a pipe shine. It's gonna be her third one. Uh... uh oh. Oh my, <laughs> okay, Bird is dead. Okay, what is Pogo doing? He's going back into the hidden scroll. Okay, he didn't do the same mistake as all the runners do sometimes and forgetting to scroll to the left to do the one hidden. Um, 
Okay, I honestly... I have a lot of trouble seeing how Haru comes back in this. Okay, nice movement though from Haru's... Uh, on Haru's side. Uh, man, this is a rough game right now. Like, what is left to take from Haru? By Haru. Hundo in Bianco, Hundo in Pina, Hundo in Sirena. Three Hundo shines. That's four goals. But that's super slow. Uh, and you need Pina. And you need Pina. You can do three from four. You have three from Bianco and two from... <laughs> And two from Pianta because you didn't complete Pianta 3. Oh, please go back to Pianta. Okay, you're you're done with this. You feel better now. You can go back to Pianta and do Pianta 3. It's damageless. You can do it. Please do it. Go back. No. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Gelato unlock into Beach Shine, Beach Pipe. And Pogo is going to trade into Pina. Probably. I haven't checked his, uh, his Shine count, but this would make sense. He got the two hidden Gelato. Oh, this is so rough for Haru. I'm, I'm trying to think about another way this game could have gone, like... Giving up on these two goals and doing something else, like the 11 blues, the hidden gelato, the da Pianta 3 damage early game as Haru, would have been so much better. I mean, it's easy to say afterwards, be like, oh, it would have been easier, but like having no progress in Bianco, like Bianco is kind of slow. And if you gotta do Bianco 2, Bianco 3, Bianco 3 hidden, Bianco 4, that's a lot of shines, and you can do some something else during that moment, during that time. Okay, Pogo is trading in. Pina race. I mean, the race is uh, pretty much over. Pogo has the shines and Haru died. I mean, exited area three times. So I don't even think Haru has the shines. Yeah. Haru is short by one. Uh, yeah, Pogo is gonna get the 12 from Pina. That's guaranteed. And then he's gonna get the... Uh, no, he's still missing secrets though, for the four secrets. Where is Haru going? Haru doesn't know. Okay, Haru's going back. No, Haru doesn't know. Haru, Haru, where are you going? Okay, NPC Blue, okay, NPC Blue. That is your second NPC Blue? Oh, okay, if you do one Fruit Lady and go to Serena 1, do Serena, Serena 100s, and the two NPCs, you get the five NPC blues and Hundo from Sirena. Yes. Yes. Do it. I don't know how bad Sirena Hundo is, but it's probably pretty bad. Sirena 1 Hundo. Let's go, first try. Okay, you got a ground pound though, I think. Let's go. 100. I mean, it's fine, right? As long as you don't spam spray the whole plaza before you can get the coins. Oh no, it's just gonna be... No, you missed a coin! What is this? Okay. Okay, she just wants the NPC blues. Which makes sense. You can get the NPC blues and you'll come back later, but... Uh, you kind of need to take risks now, with Haru. Like I would have liked to see a a Hundo play. I would have liked to see it, but I don't know. Maybe Haru is not con confident enough to do it. Five NPC blues got clicked, so I was missing one NPC on the uh, Haru side. Where did she get it, though? Like, she got one in... She got Pianta 3, the Pianta 3 one. Oh, that's why she went down. She wanted that guy for the, um, the NPCs. Okay. So, Pianta 3 
Bianco 4. That is 2. Uh, Fire Guy, that's 3. And the two Nokis, that's 5. Okay. Ah, uh, did I wish? I wish this was a Hundo from Sirena, but it's fine. It's not contested, so... I guess Haru can come back and do it later. That Hundo play. I, I, I mean, I don't even think Pogo needs the Hundos to win on this on this card right now. Like, he's just gonna get the Hundo in Pina, I guess. Into Ride Yoshi into Worlds and all the blues. Uh, in all the blue goals. He has 39 total. He needs one more blue. He needs one more blue to get that 40 points. Uh, that's 40, right? No, there's not 40. That's 50, 60, and 80. My bad. Okay. Well, Manta is going like a Manta goes uh, when it doesn't split well at the beginning. <coughs> and Pogo is not exiting area too early this time. Uh, I see someone in the chat uh, who's going to face the winner of this match. And see, that's how you want to exit area here if you want to skip the cutscene. Otherwise, you will just exit area. Just a pro tip. <laughs> All right, very nice uh, Mecha on Pogo's side, and how we're collecting the shine for Sirena one. Uh, can you use Sirena Hundo in uh, in two? I'm assuming you can't because they're like. Not many coins in the hotel in two, like the hotel is not even loaded. Okay, Haru is going back. Going back to Pienta 3. Getting that goal she deserves. Get it. It's right there. It's accessible. It's for you. And it's a pipe shine. Wait, is that gonna be the sixth one? She did beach. She did tall grass. Serena 1. Pienta 1, 2, and that's the third one. That's gonna be a second goal. That's gonna be a double click from Haru after this shine is completed. Damage this right now. Let's see it. Momentum spin. Oh come on! You already got the blues. This is not. This doesn't work twice. Okay, it worked once, but not twice. You already got those blues. Okay. Now I can. Now I can complain. Okay. There's no style points and there's no blues. So that's uh. That's a boo. <laughs> I don't agree with this play. <laughs> uh, yeah, Jeff, you will play the loser of this match. So pay close attention. Alright. What do we see here? Okay. There we go. The blue from the moon and... The shine and finally... After 33 minutes, we'll see. Pienta through the damage clicked. And six pipes from Haru. The match goes on 6 to 3. Alright. At this point, as Pogo, you know what Haru just did? Like, this is a very weird double click if it's not actually the case. So, you know that Haru did Pienta 1, Pienta 2, Pienta 3, and three other pipes. So, most likely, Tall Grass. Uh, beach spike, maybe lily pad if Haru knows the. Oh no, Haru blocks herself inside. So if you have a memory card, you can save and re reload it faster. Uh, yeah, so Pogo basically knows Haru did at least two Delfino shines, maybe three. Otherwise, it's the uh, Sirena one or Sirena Hundo delay click, but this would be like huge brain. <laughs> I don't even know why you would do such a thing, but I mean, I cannot do, do, but it's weird. Okay, here we go. Is Haru gonna go for the honey skip play? Yes. That is uh, bold. You already got the blue. Don't lock yourself inside a second time. Okay. Oh my dude. <laughs> okay, a bit too fast on the inputs here. Uh, didn't end too well. It is fine though, like Hon Honey Skip in Bingo is not necessarily not worth it, for say, but 
it gives you time to route. It's not that long of a cutscene. Like, you only save 15 seconds when you do it well. Uh, compared to just watching the cutscene. I think 80%. So it's it's fine to watch the cutscene. You have some time to relax. Look at the card and be like, okay. What is my plan now? What have I done with my life to play this match right now? Okay, Haru is not going into Pina anyway. Just wants to watch the cutscene to get some time and then do something else. Okay. Um, why do these guys go back to Bianco? Bianco Hundo? Okay, Bianco Hundo in 3 would be a good play here. Bianco 4. Uh, red coin shine? Question mark? I don't know. Uh, what? Okay, Hundo in 4. I thought Hundo was better in 3, but I may be wrong. Oh no! She stomped one of them. Slower. I mean, I guess it depends on what you learn, though. Maybe this is what. Like, then it all depends on knowledge, right? Depending on how used you are to different routes. There's a bunch of things to learn. It can take multiple days to get everything well. Oh my dude. Take your time. Take your time. Spray them well, and you'll be fine. You'll be fine. Take that coin! Take the coin! You have a free coin! F. Okay. Does she know about the particles there? So if you guys didn't know, Pokies give you one coin. But when they're not attacking you, they're like bouncing in place. And when they do, and you have like little particles above them, they give you not one, not two, but three coins. Which is worth it. Worth it. So you want to spawn them, wait a second and a half, and then jump dive on them. But if you jump dive instantly, or you kill them while they're attacking you, you're only getting one coin and that's bad. You don't want this. You want three coins from the Pokies, not one. Okay, Haru is low on water. Don't spam sp Okay, you can spam spray, but you're low on water. Uh, he did get... Okay, you're out of water, actually. Um, Pogo did get the Gelato birds, yes. The Peanut birds, at least one. I didn't see if he got the second one, like the... The annoying one, you know. The one you use Yoshi for in, uh, in 120. Are there birds on the card? Uh, no, that's not. So I, I'm guessing he didn't get the bird in, in Pina. He just get the, he just got the 12. That's a yes then. Oh yes, what? <laughs> he clicked seven. Oh, seven birds. Okay, my bad. I'm blind. I was looking at not click goals. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, Pogo going for the ro yeah turbo unlock makes total sense. Uh, he's also ahead in terms of shines, so yeah. How is Haru coming back from this? Hmm. Trying to see what's what's the game plan. To retire for commentary. This is like my fifth commentary, you know. I guess I guess I'm too old for this shit now. All right, Pogo is clicking the four secret shines. Uh, he also has access to Bianco four reds. That's a pretty slow reds, but that's a reds. Um, and that's a hidden too. How many hiddens does he have? He did. Bianco 3, Gelato 1, Gelato 1 Hidden, that's 3 Hiddens. 
uh, and that's basically it, right? So he's gonna go for Rico Progress into Rico 2 Hidden, I guess. So that's gonna be 3 from 4 at that point. Uh, is it uh... Oh, please tell me you're not missing coins and you can finish this one, Haru. Oh no, I think it's fine, but... Monka. One more. We need one more coin after this one. I'm actually surprised she didn't uh, spray the door earlier. Is it his third or fourth secret? Uh, it was its uh, fourth, since uh, he clicked it. <laughs> Alright! We got the hundo on Taru's side. Um, interesting choice of uh, episode to do it, I guess. Pogo getting some blues. He's got the 50 total now. Uh, he's almost at 60. And Haru clicks the hundo in, Pian in Bianco. And I think Pogo knows now how the game is gonna go. Like, Pogo just knows Haru has no progress in blues. Uh, or Hiddens, or Secrets, or Pina. Like, these clicks pretty much tells everything about this game right now. Which is very unfortunate, like... This double snipe at the beginning was so tragic for Haru, it's... Like, the game could have been very interesting, considering the card. But this double click was just... Too much. Like, losing so much time in early game like this is just ridiculous now it's uh now it's gonna see we're gonna try to see how much haru can take up as goals before the end of the match but yeah that's not coming there's no coming out from this unless pogo i don't know forfeits or something I don't see... Okay. Okay, Haru is going for the... Rocket... The turbo play. Which is decent, but... Where do you get the second one? You got no access anywhere. Like, Rico 7? I'm trying to think where... Haru... Wants to get her second rocket. Uh oh, that's a risky setup. Okay, it worked. <laughs> oh, Monka S, dude. <laughs> like, <laughs> okay, it's fine. It worked. It worked. Uh, uh, I'll admit that it worked. It's fine. Okay. Haru wondering what to do. Uh, I actually don't know Haru what you should do here. Uh, yeah, reds. Why not? Um. Yeah, Pogo is gonna get his uh, fourth hidden. Getting some blues on the way for the 80 total. He's got the 60 clicked. Um, yeah. Okay, Haru is dying in Pachinko. That is uh, unfortunate. But I don't think she's too sad about it. Like, we'll ask uh, at the interview, but... She told me before the match that she didn't expect to win this one. Uh, Pogo is uh, a pretty good bingo player. Um, so it's... It, all, it didn't only come up to this, right? It's not just, oh, Pogo is better this game. It's also... Haru got sniped very badly at the first two goals and this was horrible there was no good backup after this yeah so there are two words you can see on cards like ride yoshi in two worlds and for instance four shines from four three shines from four levels so a level is anything but delfino like bianco gelato pina and a world is a level or Delfino Plaza. So, yeah. 
That's uh, how it works. So basically right now we have Pogo having uh, going to collect his hidden in Rico. That's going to be three from Rico. He has three from Bianco. He has one from Pina. Did he do Pina too? I think he did. Yeah, because of the secrets. He did Pina 2, Gelato 1. Wait, no. Yes, he did. Pina 2, Gelato 1, Bianco 3, and Bianco 6. Yeah, so Haru is rushing the reds. Red coins. She did Tallgrass. Um, Pachinko. Bianco 4. Bianco 3 reds, that's 4. Am I missing some? I may be missing some. Uh, Alright, Pogo is still missing one hidden. Yeah, I guess as, as Haru right now, you... You go show off and do Serena 100. He has 3 in gelato, yeah. He did uh, the two hiddens, plus, and for this you need to do one, so yeah. Come on, sh show off the Siona 100s, please. <laughs> we want to see this. I want to see this. Okay, B Pogo is going back for the last hidden in Serena, in uh, Pina 1, Pina 2. Which makes sense, you don't want to do Bianco 6 hit reds when you can do Pina 2 reds. It's like straight up a better goal, <laughs> a better shine to do. Easier, quicker. Yeah, it was like. Um. All right. How does this go for Pogo? Pretty good. Will he get the 45 sec uh, 35 cycle? Uh, maybe not. Maybe not now. We'll see. Oh, never mind. Okay, he does. 33. And Haru going for that secret. Double click from Pogo. 3 from 4. And 5 hiddens. Um, yeah. Uh, game is not over yet. Pogo just needs... Um, Hundo in Pina. Or Turbos. Or, oh, he's going for one from each. He's gonna go for more, for one from each, I think. Which is fine. Like since he's ahead on shines, he has no key unlock. It's a it's a slow way to close the game though, but it's safe, I guess. When you know you're faster than your opponent and you're probably better. Oh, blues. Yeah, makes more sense. This would make more sense. Come on, Pogo. Please get in the... Okay, thank you. Good job. You got in the pipe. He did trade 20, yeah. He did trade in 20. Okay, how many does he have? 49. So he needs 11 more. I think he can find them all here. can find them all here. We need some cool movement to get to the underground section though. That is the question. So watch out guys, you see the gaps in the in the leaves there? They are actual gaps. So you can fall throughout the <laughs> through the gaps. You can get 14 in one. Uh oh. Yeah so that's enough. Nice. Um, yeah, we're just gonna see the, the match end right there. Ah, uh, yeah, this was a very show of similar one hundreds for us. Yeah, everybody, go to his stream and DM him. <laughs> Do similar one hundreds, please. He told me he knows how to do it. Actually, don't do it. 
It's uh, against the rules of the tournament. But yeah. <laughs> yeah, this was an unfortunate uh, match for Haru. Like, didn't really get a chance to play. After that, Bianco, it was pretty much over. With three more blues on Pogo's side. They're gonna be this guy, the nose, the one on top of the tree, and that will be G G. Uh, oh, Haru going back for C100s? Never mind. They're over in because shines. And the <laughs> final click from Pogo. That's GG. Okay, 50 minute match. This was pretty fast. Um, this was pretty fast. Yeah. Well, uh, we'll see if uh, they want uh, an interview or not. I'm gonna ask them. And I'll tell you guys very soon if they accept. Oh, okay. He's, he's putting some garbage on stream. Okay, that's getting banned. You know what? Boom. There you go. I had your your feed. <laughs> God damn. Wait, I'm gonna switch to this. There we go. What? Hi. Yo, Haru. Congrats, Congrats guys. Um, no, I played was, really bad. <laughs> this was an interesting match. I have to... How was it interesting? Please tell me. It was interesting at the beginning. Okay. At the be okay, that's fine. Because Cause... the card is very open. And in my eyes, there were multiple options on what to, how to start. Um, and you guys decided to go for the same route. Which is yeah. Bianco, Bianco. Unfortunately, so, Pogo did, got... Did, Pogo, did he delay click Floodless? He didn't. But no, you didn't. were... Wait, how did he get hidden so quick? Wait, this doesn't make sense. Wait. Haru okay. can watch the beauty. Haru, you did, you did lose a bit of time uh, entering the secret in 3. Yeah. And um, I think uh, to the World Kicks 2. Like at the beginning, the wall kicks were kind of uh, a problem. No, that was me, I think. Okay. Wait, wall kicks. Uh, for PD, before PD. Oh, I didn't have that much. Effort. And then, like you, you had six coins or five coins when Pogo clicked that goal. You realized. Yeah, and then I, I, and I immediately towards... went to hidden. You didn't directly went to hidden. You saw that right. M on the I... wall. And then you saw that NPC on the way. See, that, I didn't. I was going to the NPC in three, but like I didn't know where it was in three. This was very, very sad to us. Uh, like, seeing you that and you guys enter the secret like five seconds apart, but Haru yeah. missed the shine at the very end and yeah, died that, by like two like, seconds. I was doing dude. A, I was doing IL strats, but I screwed some stuff up. So like, uh, so you, you clicked, uh, hit it from Bianco about a second before me. I see, I see, I mean, uh, I wasn't expecting you to get this before me because you didn't click Floodless and I had a very bad in beginning, but yeah. Like, I was gonna get the NPC in 3, but I don't know what the fuck that is. So like, I wasted a bit of time with that. So, Haru, um, you went for yeah. Bianco start here. Uh, yeah. Did you, like, did you consider other options, considering you were playing against uh, Pogo, who is uh, um, presumably faster yeah. than you? Like, that's what we were talking about uh, in the commentary, like, being, okay, maybe Haru realized that she's slower than Pogo and may lose these goals. But still grab the other one? Like, is that why you went for Rico, um, uh, Bianco? Hoping to get the second one? I don't know. <laughs> this match was not very good for me. I couldn't really think at all. I just, it was such a shit match for me. 
I didn't even know what to do at the end, so I was like, fuck it, I'm gonna get Hundo in Bianco. Why the fuck not? We were Because at, at that point, I was just like, uh, I'm just gonna try and get goals. We wanted you to do 0 and 1 hundreds. Okay, I'm not. I will never do that. No! <laughs> what? Why? I. Okay, the problem with 0 and 1 hundreds for me is that I haven't practiced that shit. At all, because I don't want to practice that shit because it's just so bad. Yeah, but that was a a double click for six from pipes, and <laughs> that's true. And oh from Serena. Uh... <laughs> that's true. It's just the last time I did Serena and Hondo successfully was in 2018, and just I just didn't want to do that all that time. I would most definitely somewhere forget a coin. I just did not want to risk that. Okay, Pogo, how did you feel about this match? <laughs> um, During the match. I don't know. I was expecting Haru to, to start Pianta and to do some gelato after. That's why I didn't do the, the, the hiddens right after the blues of gelato. See, what happened with that is, I went to Pianta first to get, like, no damage, but, like, some shit happened. Yeah, I can Pianta imagine. Pianta the NPC, Haru got hit, like, damageful. I don't even, I don't damage. even know what I got. It was definitely not damageful, it was some other shit, because I was, like, very close to the ground. Maybe I don't even know what hit me. To you? I don't even know. It, uh, dude, I don't even, I don't even know what it was. Did so, you slide off and fall and hover? I don't know. You don't know what you did? Oh well. Remember, dude. Uh, um, what did you think Haru was, Pogo, when uh, like you got Bianco 3, Bianco 4, I mean Bianco 4, Bianco 3, you got the two hidden gelato and nothing was clicked yet from Haru. What did you have in mind at that point? Where do you think how it was? I was like, she she gotta be in Pianta. I'm not gonna go there because I'm gonna get sniped. So I just did my stuff on my way to Pina and, and left Pianta behind me. And I never went to the outer world. That's it. And when she clicked it, I... Like, when I saw five NPCs, I was like, okay. So this has to be Pianta 6. And then she clicks Pianta for no damage and six pipes and I'm like, you click this after NPCs? You you, you think you're gonna make me believe this, but it was actually the case. <laughs> so yeah. Yeah, because of That's the all I thought this match. Well there was at only Pianta three pipes, uh, bird and NPCs, but I thought it was not good enough to, to start Pianta in my opinion. Like birds, you can get them in, in Bianco, you can get uh, reds in Bianco, you can get hiddens, you can get two golds, you can get blues, you can get a lot of things, secrets. So yeah, I just decided to start Bianco, Bianco instead. What did you guys think on this card, and this is probably going to be my last question, um, about the hundos. Like there are four hundo goals on this card. How do you see like, when you saw them? What do you think of them? Well, I was like, well, I guess I could do this at some point, but uh, I I didn't really want to do them if I did not have to. That's all I, I thought about these. Why not? But didn't want to do them. <laughs> and not all of them, all, not four of them. You know, I wanted to go to Serena 1, Hando, when I got um, 5 hiddens, and I was like, no, I wanna, I just wanna get the 80 blue coins, let's go. Chat wanted you to do this, actually. What? Chat wanted Pogo to end with the Hando in Serena 1. Yeah, it's dated, I was like, no, I'm not feeling it, I just wanna end <laughs> this match. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's fair. What about you, Haru? Um, 
I don't know, if I'm done with seeing me get it, don't mind. I didn't want to go to Penna because Pogo has done a 12 in Penna, so I was like, he's probably going to do Hundo there, so I just didn't bother. Yeah, that's fair. Alright, let me pull up the bracket now. Uh... Am I facing Jeff? I think you I think are facing uh, Jeff, Haru. So it's not... Yeah. You're still playing in the tournament. Okay, my stuff is not working. Hey, there you go. Okay, so Haru, you're gonna face Jeff uh, next week in a loser's run too. So... Yeah, that's it. Yeah, Jeff. How do you feel about the uh, upcoming match? Against Jeff? I've never played Jeff one of one. I know he is pretty good at rounding because he got taught by Ramado in the 2v2. So I know he has really good rounding, so I probably need to practice on rounding before I feel confident about it. Do you think it's doable? Mm -hmm. Probably. Probably? Okay. I mean, I think. Jeff is uh, one of these people who does scream a lot, so if you can find yeah. him online during uh, like this week or this weekend, you may be able to scream against him before the match and analyze his way of playing. Get some info. Ask a lot of questions after the match. <laughs> Get in yeah. his head. Understand. Uh, all right. So, um, Pogo, you'll be moving in round three of winner brackets. Uh, you'll be facing Danny. How do you feel about well, this match? Well, the question was asked like uh, one hour ago. Yeah, but you were the for one Danny. asked. <laughs> I mean, I will see. <laughs> I don't really know. He's faster than me, but hasn't played a lot of bingos, so. And he said he I'm gonna practice. try to beat him. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. There's a difference between saying and doing. Oh, you're saying he's a liar? I see. <laughs> yeah, he said he was gonna get, I don't know, sub free, sub free 10 by the summer in in 120 Shine in 2019, and he didn't, so he's a liar. Have it? No, he didn't wow. touch in 120 Shine for a year. Well, I guess uh, he's not going to practice then. You win. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> GG. Guys, change of prediction. Pogo is going to win against Danny. <laughs> Anyhow, thank you guys for the game. Um, it was really rough for you, Haru, because of that double snipe at the beginning. Um, yeah. Your, your reds were was totally fine too. It was really cool to see. Like That was a very tense race inside the level and... Missing the yeah, I feel the like was the, the. I feel like if I had gone a little faster and didn't like mess up the beginning, I definitely would have had it. Yeah, and it's uh, it happens. It happens. No, oh, thank you guys for watching. I think we're done for today. There's no other matches today. The next one will happen tomorrow. Um, I'm not sure what time. Can someone tell me about this? I don't know. It'll happen at some point. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Info. That's a Discord. Uh, Wednesday, 3 p.m., 9 p.m., there you go. 11 a.m. Thursday, there you go. Wow, I'm not going to be up. You'll not be able to watch? I won't be up because I'll be sniping. Um, and the match will be against... Uh, Will feature Odd Me versus Alias. Alias. Bro, I have to, that's gonna be sick. Except I won't watch it. We'll see uh, who wins. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys people. later. Let's have to host someone now.